ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, welcome back to another episode of The Secret World. In the last episode, we finally got to level 12 that we needed to continue on with the main mission of the story. And we are doing so right now, heading towards the sewers as we speak. I know we ended off the last episode in the sewers, but let's go ahead and head on back. I didn't feel like staying there, you know, after a while. So, let's see. Doing good. All right. So, now, what must we do? We must find Joe Slater, but... No, 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 no. There we go. Just kill the monster. Kill the monster. Beautiful. Okay. So, we took care of that guy right there. Now we must find this Joe guy. So, obviously not this way. Let's be careful with how we approach. Fagler Impaler. I think we're going to get we're going to fight this one anyways. So let's go ahead and get our shots in while we can. Oh, watch out. Get our shotgun, save them up. There we go. I'm just blasting at this point. Oh, these familiars look familiar. These sewers look familiar as shit. Were these the same sewers we were on in previously? Ooh. Doesn't look like it, but man. Can be a bit scary, so let's try to avoid as much as possible here. Yikes. Alright, so now let's see if we can just Hmm. See if we can avoid Nope. Can't avoid. Ah shit, here they come. Okay, got one killed. Oh shit. Yep. I was just waiting. I've been waiting for a monster like you to pop into my life. Oh, I've been waiting. Okay, sorry. That was a... Uh... Whew, that song is way too damn old. Even it's older than me, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. Whoa, what is that? Is this where we find Joe? That's a big motherfucker. We fought one of these before, though. Alright. Let's go ahead and shoot them real quick. Oh, we've been barriered. So now we got this big fuck here. Oh, no, the fall prevents from going any further. So that means I have to freaking kill them first. Oh, I didn't realize an impaler was involved. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and refill. Let's just wait. Hello. Yeah. Uh, I do apologize about that. Uh, very sorry. My mother, my mother scared the shit out of me just now. <laughs> oh no! You know what? I got to. Uh, you know what? I, know, I don't think I can continue on. I think I have to go. No. I can't leave either. Oh, leaving the event area. Okay. Alright, so we're in an event area. I guess I got no choice but to keep going. So, here we go. Our gun here. Up, oh, pistol. Out of pistol. Out of pistol. Out of pistol. There we go. All right. Come on. Move it. Move it. Move it. All right. 
right, come on, hurry up and die already, shit. Are we done? Are we done? Yes, finally, we can destroy off the, that big guy now. We got a brute, uh oh, back away, back away. Get some, uh... All right, so far we're doing good. Oh, that was close, that was a close call for the brute. Damn. Got side swiped, got side swiped. Beautiful. Killed 50 draw. Oh, achievement. Nice. Very nice. That is awesome as heck. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Alright, my apologies. I was up early, had the thought, because I thought I was taking my mother to the doctor's, but apparently my cousin is taking her. So, yeah, sure, I guess she'll probably call me later, which is weird because the appointment wasn't until 12.30, so I figured I'd kill some time. Okay, here we go. We got this guy. Who is this fuck right here? A brute source. Alright, come on. A little bit. Can I even move? Okay, I was about to say. Oh, no, 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 no. He's, he's uh, busting those things up. Shit. Back away, back away. Alright, still in good health, so I think I'm, I'm still okay for now. Back, uh, backflip, backflip, there we go. Ah, oh, crap, you brought out another one. Backflip! Oh no, I got him killed. Alright, he temporarily stunned me. Sea collars and all these broods coming out of their eggs. There we go. Oh damn, they're pretty damn good for our health. There we go. Alright, so I think we're okay for now. Hang on, are we fully healed? Are we good? There we go. Is this Joe Slater? Yeah, it's Joe Slater. Oh boy, here we go. Cutscene! Look on your face says even my good side is worse for wear. I've been trying not to think about the changing. Good lord. Like it could all be a bad dream I have woken up from. Nightmares. All nightmares since that storm blew us off course. <clears throat> off the compass. Off the map. <clears throat> we didn't tell anyone about the shit we saw. About dead ships all caught up in red weed as far as you could see. Red weed? About the things moving in the fog. In the water. <clears throat> about what we saw beneath it all. Deep into the abyss. <clears throat> Or what I found there. In that dungeon darkness, it shone like a signal flare. Like something fallen down from heaven above, you understand? A blade made of pure light. A thing of terrible beauty. I could hear its siren song just, just calling me. By the way, the siren song in this game, Last beautiful. Was the Creed boys hollering as I took a hold of it. Jura took a hold of me. I wasn't strong enough. I, I know that now. They told me it pushed back the fog and the waves while I was out cold. Told me it saved us. <clears throat> it didn't save us. That thing brought the fog back to Kingsmith. I brought the fog back to Kingsmith. And I still hear that siren song. <laughs> I know you hear it too. You could find it. You could stop that powerful noise. Put that burning brightness back where it belongs. In the deep. In the dark. I wonder what would have happened if I never left that Red Sea. Maybe Joe Slater never did. And all this is just some. It's dark dreaming. Well. That is truly something else. 
Joe here, attacked by the, you know, attacked by the, the sirens. Not by the siren song per se, but with the fog and transformation. The siren song is what saved his life, supposedly. And now, pretty soon, we're going to be able to hear it. So we're going to use the siren song and follow it. Let's go ahead and get back out of these sewers here. All right. Now, in the game, the siren song lasts only about a minute, but go on YouTube to look up the song of the siren, and my god, it is, it's, it is beautiful. It really is a beautiful song. I mean, it's just like, it's supposed to, what the fuck? Zed Flamer Johnson. Whoa, okay. All right. And I had numbers flash before my very eyes. And I have more numbers showing up. Okay, what the hell's going on here? Man, this has been one heck of a morning. Uh oh, got the way. Beautiful. Okay, there we go. So where are we located at now is what I'm wondering. Let's use, view the map real quick. Where are we? Okay. Where we? I know where we're at now, so let's go ahead and make our way where we're supposed to go. This way. We use shift and one for the siren song. We have to follow it. Alright, I'm going to shut up for a second let you listen to it. Located within this building here. Let's go ahead and enter the maintenance tunnel. Yeah, like I said, the siren song, it's like the song is beautiful itself, especially like the melody and of the voice of it. It's just mesmerizing. So let's see. All right. We're in here now. Ugh. Someone, uh, didn't take too kindly. All right. So now, what we're gonna have to do? Can we? Can we get over there? Will it allow us? Let me see. I don't remember. I don't remember if you have to turn off a switch. All right. Nothing over here. Hmm. Jump over the lasers there. All right. So I think we should be. Oh, here we go. Beautiful. Another cutscene coming up. Finally silenced the incessant noise and moved it to a safer place. So where did... Away from here. I'm not in a sharing mood, Cassandra, and the moaning isn't helping. That's not what you said last night. Oh, baby, I thought we had something. Something magic. Black as space and red as blood. <sighs> this is so very far beyond you, little girl. Fuck off. I've seen the beyond. 
and I'm a fast learner. I'm ready for more than this. Give me something. Let me in. Let me do what I... What? Getting the boys to sign over their lives for a snog. I'll tell you what you can do. We're spreading an idea, but that idea won't take hold without Carius. You keep spreading those long legs of yours to recruit more foot soldiers. Be still, my beating heart. Here's what I don't get, Beaumont. You have what you've been looking for. Your precious magic sword. You control the armies of the living dead. You pretty much own this island. So the question is... Why the sour face? I mean, what is it that you're... You're missing something, right? Now, this is interesting. Your treasure, your... your precious... You can't use it, can you? I mean, the spirit is willing, but the flesh... Oh my, the flesh is limp. Watch it, little girl. You have no idea what... What? What? You want to know what this is really about, Cassie, dear, when it all comes down to it? Mm. Change. Evolution. A new dawn. The world tree will shake. The sun will turn black. And the gods themselves will fall. We are rebooting the world. That's the thing, isn't it? What everyone talks about. It's the big headline. The dawning of a new age, right? Tokyo. The endless night. I like it. There's poetry to it. And oh, does it suit you. The evil sorcerer thing. It's sexy. The answer is in the archives somewhere. It has to be. They knew about it. The gateway to the black heart of the island. I had the key, but... The lock. The lock is the fucking thing. Wait, didn't you say that the lock... I've been around long enough to recognize the flavor of the day, Cassie. You're it. <clears throat> oh, really? So that's it. That's how you repay me, you piece of shit. No more. Take one last good look at what you're missing. Lover boy. Useless bitch. The Illuminati. And their bloody labyrinths. What a whore. But anyways, yeah. Now we got some more information as to what's going on around here. Beaumont is the man behind all of this. Let's inspect his notes. Black heart of the tunnel. Illuminati archives. Fucking tunnels. Must be an entrance, but where? Several entrances all lead to archives. One basement secret forgotten and conspicuous. Aerial view. Scenic tour. Oh. Kingsmith Municipal Airport. <sighs> Looks like we know where we have to go, but unfortunately, we are not at the correct level to do so. We have to now be at a level 14, and we're coming up on 13 soon enough, so you know what that means. More missions! Alright, and speaking of missions, there's one coming up here. Actually, one along this side. And it actually took me the longest to figure this out, because I didn't realize, at first... All these, uh, well, they're not there anymore, but all of these, I always used to see all of this uh, covered. I never knew this flickered. So, let me see. Is it possible if we go over here to figure out what's over on this side? Now, watch out for the cameras. If you get hit, if you, it, 
if you get uh, if they locate you you're screwed so be careful do not get caught by those let me see. Was there something over here we could fuck with? I believe it used to be. Oh, no, no, no. That's for a mission. That is for a mission. So I do have to go back outside. Have to go see the hippie for that one because that is a level 12 mission. But yeah. So Beaumont, speaking of which, is with that little whore that's sleeping with everybody to recruit more fo foot soldiers. You know, she thinks she's all prideful because, you know, she apparently she has some good, uh, like, you know, she has the goods. But let me tell you something, sweetheart. Even all those goods wear off after a while. So, and I know usually in this kind of world, you know, they always say that men, women can live without men and men cannot live without, uh, men cannot live without women, which is, I, for the most part, true. But especially nowadays, because, like, what they, what they describe pretty much is, like, 2017 in a nutshell. Sexuality, guys are like, oh, well, you know, you do this for me and stuff like that, and, you know, sexual harassment claims and whatever the fuck. The only difference is we do not have a, you know, a fog over the United States right now. This ain't the mist. Just before... The fuck is that? Just before the fog hit Kingsmith, local old local called Old Town Fog Plant asking the sheriff to remove Martin Light members trespassing on his land. Chaos since no one seems to heard from Tom one line McCam. Tom still very so with the trying to take my hand. Read the whole complaint and then look for Tom. So I need to read the complaint for him. So let's go ahead and take care of that real quick. Hippies. Would you goddamn cops do your goddamn job and get those guys? Good lord, my man. Hippies off my land. It ain't a campground. They've been up to some merry shit. I've tried making my case peaceful like, and they up and threaten me. Now one of my dogs is going missing. I swear if you don't do something about it, I'm going to take it in my own hands. My Atkins. Now we got to search for old Tom. So we're back out this way. I don't even want to know what's on the other side of that shit. Yep, we gotta go to the hippie land over here. Oh, it's a nice little animal well that shows us where we can resurrect. And we have the hippie camp here with these devices that help save them from the monsters. Not kidding. So, let's see. Where is the hippie dude? The pickup. Alright, so now let's go ahead and do this one. Cassandra in the morning lies making the pickup and will welcome some company of past protection. Jay is not covering when pick up the fan because after previous up the courier, he suggests you tag along. Let's accept this one. Another cutscene coming up. Our intrepid fucking hero. Pretty impressive stunt you pulled out there. I got my good eye on you. As opposed hey, to his bad hey, eye. Hey, Cassie. This oh, it's the puta. Okay, here we hey go. There. Hot stuff. Bitch, I just saw you. And your weapon. Cassandra is our resident Mary Magdalene. Don't let those doe eyes fool you. She'll eat you up. I do have a big appetite. Comes with being southern, I guess. Oh, Not being that a whore. Jesus here would notice. He's immune to my female charms. Boy's got no spunk. Anyway, Che, I need to talk to you. There's an issue with, uh, you know. Who's doing the pickup? I am. And who else? I'm going solo. I can handle myself just as well as... Not gonna happen, babe. You could get your pretty little ass hurt bad out there. Your concern is heartwarming, Jay. I'm sure it's got nothing to do with wanting to keep an eye on me. Trust issues. Hey, feel like doing us a favor? Call it your ticket to a new Jerusalem. When we finished building. If that's the kind of company you're talking about, well then, I might be flexible. Get your okay. STD-ridden puss out of my face. He's talking about sexual positions. That's what that little pause was. No shit. It's her idea of subtlety. Fuck off. We could get to know each other better. I'd like to find out what lies beneath those I wonder if the Templar's orders. health insurance plan oh, no that they worry. mentioned at the very beginning far. of the game covers Maybe sexually transmitted diseases and whores. Okay with you, Jesus. Don't look at me like that, shit. I'm only, getting, I'm only doing this because I'm getting experience for this. And not that kind of experience either. I don't want your experience. You keep your experiences away from me. 
I'm trying to save the world. I could probably find better honeys than you after I do so. Anyways, so now we have to go back in here because we have to complete that mission. Go into the maintenance tunnels and escort Cassandra. Cassandra. I don't know. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Don't move and enter we go. What the fuck happened here? Somebody's been tampering with the security. You bitch! It's been you all along! No. Lucky thing I have you here. Maybe I'll get to see you. Flex your muscles. Well, I would insult you. Like, well, you can flex my... But, you know, I don't want you know, I, I know you're, you're infected. And not, well, I don't think any infection is eye-pleasing. So, let me see. <laughs> Remember, the STDs are a terrible thing, baby. All right. So, now, okay, there is a... Careful. Motion sensors. Yep. Yeah, be careful. So you gotta be careful. Alright, so now let's guide over this way. Watch out for the motion sensor cameras. You can see those and how it points on the floor. Oh boy. There's a box over there somewhere. I've seen B use it. Okay, how do I crouch again? If we could get that reactivated. I thought I was using it. There we go. Why can I not use the laser grid controls? I'm using them. All right, let me not touch anything for a second. Yeah, oh, shit. Okay, there we go. All right, hold on. Okay, men in dress purple are in here. They're guarding room with more security concerns. Deactivate security field and move on. Okay, so that's tier three. Let's go ahead and keep it moving. All right, here we go. Security field controls once again. All right, we gotta be careful. Hold on. I remember Bee telling me this place connects to the sewers. With the sewers. Whoa, hello. <laughs> Scared the crap out of me for a second. Okay, so I'm at level 13 now. So let's see, hit points increase by 60, attack by 40, heal by 40. And we have to play pick a door. And I believe, if I'm not mistaken, it's the left one here. Bring her in here. Where is she? If I'm not mistaken. All right, got that. Cross the electric. What the fuck? Another one of these little countermeasures keeps the drag out. They don't like being that. All right. So. Watch your step. Okay. You can see what parts electrified on the floor, so you want to be careful. Back up a little bit. Just the arrow keys don't don't really move much else. All right, always keep it no, down this way. Beautiful. Cross the electric grid. Figure it 
All right, so now. Well, watch out for the lasers. Hmm. How do we know which one to use? Oh, it's a play. It's a game. We got to match all the all the grids here, and do we got it? Do we got it? Beautiful. So here's the deal. I'm gonna level. With you. It's better for everyone. Uh oh. This package doesn't end up with those fucking morning light hippies. We're a different breed, you and I. We're better than they are. So let me take this with me and go through that door, and I will owe you a favor. A big one. Do we have a deal? Don't keep me waiting. What the fuck? I have to go. Believe me, I hate this as much as you do. We'll Damn it. see each other again when the both of us have grown a bit. I'd like that very much. Ah, uh, so there's more to you than just being a whore. When I'm ready for you, you'll know where to find me. I promise. Okay, so now I'm going to fix that little audio issue by just recording it post, at least for commentary purposes. So let's see what's going on here. Making our way out again, these lasers, and if you do touch them, they will hurt you. So let's go ahead and make our way out. So to pick up, we gotta leave the maintenance tunnels. We finished the mission already from that fucking bitch. Although we had a feeling she, well, like, well, we already knew she was a bad bitch anyway. So not like it made a difference or anything of the sort. So we shall see. And we're gonna cut in a minute second here. There we go. So after some equipment adjustments later, basically some weapons upgrading or you know degrading or whatever the case may be and as I mentioned here we do finish the trespassers mission by the end of the video so we are making our way towards that right now trying to find us uh, trying to search for old Tom here and old Tom ain't looking uh, ain't looking so good and can't seem to find him anywhere so let's see look around the camp base and so far we're already seeing nothing whole lot of nothing going on here all right old time up here somewhere no he's not so we know he's in the area so I know he's in the area because that big old circle tells me he's in the area and oh look at this we got some zombies is that old Tom over there oh my voice it got squeaky oh my god I need water just shoot these little motherfuckers over here. Kill them for experience, because we could use it. St trying to reach level 14, so that way we continue on with the main story mission. If we could find this old fuck over here. Just keep on moving, keep it shaking, keep it baking. And I still haven't found this guy yet, amazingly. Now back at the hippie camp. Uh, where is that son of a bitch? Where is that bastard? Yeah. We're almost done with this one, folks. I can assure you. So. Let's see. Let's go ahead and make our way through what it looks like. Nope. We're outside the circle now. So he's not located. He's located somewhere. I know he is, folks. I know he is. And I apologize. So. Hopefully we can find them soon, and, well, 
You know what? Fuck them. Well, thanks to my idiocy of not checking the volume after the cutscene. But, anyways, I am ending the part here. So, with that, I do like to thank you guys for watching. I hope you have yourselves a fantabulous night. Love, peace, and chicken grease to all of the awesome ones out there. May you have yourselves an awesome one.